So what we have here is a file of Turin's um, university correspondence, which Professor Miles found. Um, it deals with his academic and professional activities during his period at Manchester between 1948 and his death in 1954. Well, it, it was quite surprising, really. We, we found a filing cabinet which has quite a lot of old prints. Um, uh, which we're all known about uh, and I was quite excited to find the filing cabinet because they were thought to have been lost uh, and so we found quite a few of those and I was gradually working through those and when I got down to the bottom the back of the bottom drawer of the filing cabinet I <coughs> saw this um, orange folder um, and I looked at it and I thought oh somebody must have just reused that and I didn't really look at it first and then of course I had to go through it and find out what it was and sure enough it was actually all of the copies of Turing's correspondence from his time here, so that's quite exciting. Turing's, Turing's biographer, Andrew Hodges, has already taken a look at the material. So it, um, it is important for um, substantiating what we know about Turing's work at Manchester, so it does add some extra detail about that. Um, there is information about particular uh, pieces of work he did on um, artificial intelligence, um, morphogenesis in plants, for his last piece of major research. Uh, so it adds some detail to that, but also how he worked as a member of university staff. Uh, one letter is particularly, uh, I found particularly noteworthy is his uh, letter from the director of GCHQ um, asking him to provide a photograph for a, um, a history that an American cryptographer was writing about uh, cryptography during the Second World War. Uh, at this time, Turin's work at Bletchley Park is still secret, nobody really knows about it, um, so it's not mentioned in any of the other letters, we get no sense of that. But um, this particular letter does indicate, um, it provides evidence of that work and it indicates I think some of the regard that Turin was held in by, uh, by the people who'd worked with him during the war.